the important thing to understand is you can't you can't shortchange yourself. Like you're not you're not cheating anybody but yourself. Right? I mean, you're tired. You're literally this far away from the line. Why would you not go that extra to touch the line? Right. So if I let him get away with that, right, all of a sudden he starts maybe a cheat something over here, right? Not give his best over here, not give his best over here. And as years go on, he's gonna be extremely, he's not gonna reach his full potential because he's been taking these little shortcuts that just add up, add up, add up, add up, add up. And you can't let that happen. Our, our job as teachers, as mentors, as inspirers, it's our responsibility to hold them accountable to those things. It wasn't that long ago. We all mourned after our election. Our hero. Truth be told, we still hurt. In memory of the star, Kobe once stated, everything negative, the pressure, the challenges, are all an opportunity for us to rise. Those words paint a vivid picture of the real model he was. A perfect example of what to follow. As the world continued to be shaken up by devastation, manipulation, and an overread amount of misled information, our communities need a healing. I've seen a lot of people talk about the change, but not be the change. Now what if I told you there's a guy by the name of Marcus, who is the epitome of what that change is, consistently doing what is necessary to see people in the community make it, bringing the youth, the teenagers, and young adults under one roof, together, for one reason and one reason only, and that is, to strive above others. Strive above others, a brand that is for the people. Life is a game he figured out how to play, while recreating a better representation of the landscape. A plan is in place to get home wherever they want and whatever they heart desire, by supporting every player with positive energy and lifting each other up. Much higher. Starring Marcus Kirk. Change is coming, one day at a time. Marcus is making sure that, helping the younger generation prepare mentally and physically for the future. I'm Lorenzo Jackson, head coach of the 12U EG Royals. So basically what we decided to do here is work with Marcus, have him come out and train some of these boys. Our team was designed to get some of the boys that may have started basketball a little bit later, but had a ton of potential to bring them under our umbrella and start working with those guys, get them a little bit better at basketball so they get to the level eventually where they can start to compete. And one of the special things about Marcus and Strive Above Others is that he saw that vision. Uh, he's been working with kids for a very long time, helping those kids develop and uh, so we started to put together a program right here in the backyard. That's a one drill pull up. Let's go. Next six. We poured the cement back here, put a hoop for it back here, so these boys have a space to work. And Marcus was like, hey, look, I got some guys that would like to train and get together and start putting some, you know, start working on their game uh, and developing. 
and I like what you're doing. I like your vision. I like how you approach the game. I'm like, hey, let's 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 come together. Let's do something together. As you see, you see a ton of boys, a ton of parents that have faith in us and what we're doing and putting together to develop these boys and getting them Next. getting them going. Come on, Cam. Mix. For us, we really wanted to affect change in the kids' minds. Let them know that they can play at a high level, eventually get to that point. You know, what they put into this, they're going to get out of it. So, that was the vision. It's a lot, right? You would say a lot. There's way more people that want to do the same thing you're doing. So all this laughing around, what if I was a, trying to, AAU team, I'm trying to look for, I'm a college coach, I'm trying to get a player. Y'all laughing around, goofing around, right? As you can see, we build this up in here. We don't need you to have fun, hee hee ha ha, right? I picked some of y'all up to come here to work, not to be friends and joking around. This is serious. If you guys play AAU, that means your parents are paying money. So you guys are invested now, there's no more games. That makes sense to everybody. Okay, water break and come back. I need better energy. The message was quite clear. Although we like to have fun, you should know your purpose and see the value to become a better version of yourself. The fun didn't stop there. Shortly after, Marcus and a few others decided to take their game to the open run. open runs together for the community. I'm trying to get everybody on the right path. Um, a, not, a lot of players were out because of the coronavirus and then with the, the police brutality and everything that's going on right now, I'm just trying to pick up my brothers and sisters, you know what I mean? Pick everybody up, put everybody on the same page, stay focused on, on basketball and forget everything else that's kind of going on right now. 
Um, just trying to be that positive influence in the community and continue to build from there. Um, we had great players come out today. Um, hopefully I could continue to do this until they go back to school and everything get back on track. But I'm just right now just trying to be that mentor in the community, that, that, that leader that you know, I think we need right now. We need a leader to put everybody on, you know what I'm saying, on that positive wave, you know what I mean? So just trying to be the positive person I could be. Man, it's tough. Uh, today we had a little situations, but we're going to move past that. You know, continue to build these open runs and continue to build, strive of others with, every, with everything, man. And strive of others is bigger than, bigger than basketball. It's, you know what I mean? It's, it's a family. It's about the community and building each other up. We must not take our dreams, the advice, nor mentors for granted. Dream as if you will live forever and live as if you will die today. Give the generations a platform to strive above others. These are the times we must rebuild the community that shows love to each other and not hate. This game is a beautiful thing, especially when everyone is moving forward together. Be someone that supports your peers and be revered forever. Be careful of those who rather see you down and put your soul in the fire. You put your faith in God. You ought to know that devil is a liar. Much higher.